In this uh, demonstration today what I'll do is I'll uh, break this uh, bridge using uh, different uh, particle flow techniques. I'm using mostly what we've done for Max 2014 uh, in particle flow. I'm going to use a lot of the new operators that, we, uh, that we've integrated in 2014. And I've built that demo for Seagraph. I was doing um, a, a lot of demos at Fusion IO, which uh, is a company that specializes in extremely fast uh, input and output devices. So I wanted to take advantage of the caching system of particle flow, the new, part, the new disk caching system to show that massive particle system can be streamed from the Fusion I.O. card uh, the, the, you know, at uh, very fast rates. So this is the scene that I've built here and I used the uh, Gribbled modifier. Just I just built a very simple bridge here and I've surrounded it with a few elements so that we can make something that's very chaotic uh, as an explosion and break, uh, break things apart uh, so that it's uh, interesting. So that's kind of the idea here. Uh, I used the Gribble modifier. I'll show it a bit later but the idea for the Gribble, uh, gribble well, I don't know how it's pronounced exactly but uh, if I just to add a, um, a box here. Of course, it's pink, so I'm just going to make it grayish. So I'm going to go back here in the modifier stack, and you see that the gribble modifier is here, and uh, I've made it uh, zero taper. And you can add uh, density, you know, increase the density of, the, of details there, and uh, it's the gribble, uh, gribble uh, modifier. So that's pretty much how I did it. I just uh, modeled the, the, these to add details and elements. That would be interesting to work with for this uh, destruction. So what I'll do here is I'll show you the final. So this is a uh, a rendered preview. So the water here is, I know it's a bit um, um, regular in terms of a wave pattern, but uh, I'll show you how you can change that a bit later. But this is kind of what we're going to be uh, looking for. So we're breaking everything using particle flow. You see the bridge here is kind of collapsing on itself, acting as a soft, uh, kind of a soft body, to, so that we're going to see how to build that. We have the water at the bottom uh, with water splashes and things like that. So the water is all made with particles as well. And we just added the blob mesh on top. So we'll see that technique as well. And just to give you an idea, I, I've kind of rendered uh, the uh, with the blob mesh and without the blob mesh and also without the mesh. So you see that all of these here are all particles uh, done with particle flow and we're going to see how, set, how to set it up during this uh, blog post. So I hope you enjoy and um, so that's all done in Max 2014 with the new particle flow uh, operators that we've added for this version.